in 2019 a crack cycling unit were framed by video and uploaded to YouTube. These cyclists promptly escaped through closed roads, gravel, commute specials and into the Somerset Underground. Today, still wanting Velovue tiles, they survive as cyclists of fortune. They have a problem and nobody can help them. But if you can find them, maybe you can ride with the Mendip team. Right, so good morning and welcome back to another video. Look, trees back up straight, so it's not all bad. We're running a bit late though, because somebody's just useless at getting ready. Trying to put so many layers on this morning. But we are going to the Chard Cycleway, so we're going via Ilminster to Chard. There's quite a few bike paths, uh, so it should be very, very good. Hopefully it's not going to rain. The sun is out. It's a little bit fresh, but not too bad at all. I've got Di and I've got Pete. I can't move my hands the right way. I've got Di and Pete. <laughs> Forget that. Uh, I've got Di and Pete, so there's just three of us today. Everybody else is busy or put off by the cold weather. But uh, let's get this done. Should be a nice rundown. Although I have put in Ham Hill and I don't know why. That's a bit of a root malfunction for me. All my thoughts are running, running around inside my head. Emotions keep coming, they're keeping me from thinking straight. Thought it would be different. When I got my things in place, stuck in this commotion. How come I ain't passed this yet? I wanna be the beast. Yeah, root malfunction, root malfunction. <laughs> I don't know why I ever put this hill in. Ah, uh, it's odd though. I love hills. This one though is my nemesis. And I have no idea why. Ham Hill. Do you want anybody to notice we just slip into the bakery and just have a coffee and cake? <laughs> Join the other cyclists. Because uh, cafe wise today, uh, it's either Costa Coffee, which is a little bit of a pain to get to, or there's a pub. Do you do fish and chips? Probably. <laughs> <laughs> I don't bother where we go today. And the, uh, as, as per my usual, oh, there's there's a cafe for this yeah. route. Your track record on then, cafe then when I looked, closed. closed. <laughs> no. It's not your fault, darling. No, bloody pandemic. It just closed do, loads uh, of cafes. You do generally work quite hard to make sure <laughs> that we find a, a watering hole. Yeah. And in fairness, we found some nice ones, haven't we? <laughs> Super well, you put me under pressure with all this bacon now. Yeah. Even though I changed. Really made an effort, promised I would change, but something stayed the same. Wanted to do better, wanted to be great, but something stayed the same. So we're just debating exactly where we are. I think we're on the outskirts of Ilminster, so hopefully not far from the cafe. I think we're about to go through Dillington House. We must have a, a little turn up here somewhere that gets us into the uh, private cycle path into the house. Hopefully. <laughs> that was I'm completely lost. On the left eye. Yeah. You like that then, Pete? <laughs> Fuck yes. You been there before? No, no, it's a new one. Yeah? Lovely, isn't it? It's a bit of a house, isn't it? Should I let us in for a cup of coffee? <laughs> You'd want more than a little fly mode to do that long. <laughs> yeah, I should think. <laughs> What's the bumps up there? You'll like this bit, Pete. Sorry? You'll like this bit. This is a nice, uh, nice little cycle path down to the main road now. This is bouncing bike territory or uh, road bike territory? No, it's road bike. Yes, yeah, so there's some uh, really tall trees down through here. Very nice little path. 
I'm getting about ready for some coffee and some bacon, hopefully. Or there was actually a burger on the menu. Could I? Would I? <laughs> Bacon and sausage beat. <laughs> we got the works this morning. <laughs> I tell you what, it's, you, it's hitting the spot. You have let us down. Right, so firstly, if you're passing across the coffee, I thoroughly recommend those pigs under blankets. Oh, that's Christmas in a bun, that is. Beautiful. We managed to make our way back over to the child cycle way though. And this goes from Ilminster all the way to Chard Reservoir. Beautiful off-road cycle path. So we're heading into the Doniat station and we're just going to enjoy the beautiful scenery all the way to the reservoir. I know what you're thinking. Are you really doing yet? I'm oh, sorry about that. <laughs> my, my sense of humour. This is such a beautiful day. It's uh, quite windy, but it is not cold. Definitely not as cold as last week. Still no gloves. Do it in one, do it in one. <laughs> so like there's optional excursions when you're on holiday. When the Redkin said, we have to charge reservoir. <laughs> hey, we're off route though, Pete. That's our route, the gravel. <laughs> in it? Look at that, eh? How long has it been here? Uh, flooded, a long time. There, there's a there's sign post with some history on it there if you want to read it. Or something flooded or... No idea. No idea whatsoever. I didn't realise that was him. Stunning. So I've shown you something else you never knew was it even here then, Pete? Nothing. No, learning all the time. <laughs> it really is lovely though. As I said, I mean, this is the best time of year of seeing it. The, yes. the atmosphere is clear. Yeah. yeah. Gorgeous. Sun reflection off the yeah. lake there. Yeah. No haze. Really lovely. Yeah. Now you just got to go back to Glastonbury though. <laughs> We've had our coffee, had our uh, sausage Pig, roll. Pigs under blankets, We're, Pete. Uh, ready to go. <laughs> yeah, if you've not done that cycle path, I highly recommend it. And it does bring you here. There are some picnic spots. There are cafes in Elminster. Uh, and it, it does actually go all the way into Chard as well. Uh, we turned off just a little bit early. But uh, really nice. Really needs to be more cycle paths, I think. I didn't expect that. <laughs> I've heard that on the video so many times. <laughs> Who put a hill here, Pete? Wish that I could stay in this moment forever so I can hold you in my Yeah, perhaps I should rename the channel Tales of the Unexpected. <laughs> Who put that hill there? I don't know. But I guess you're a nice view. It's not often you uh, ride up a road it's got a meadow in the middle either. <laughs> what was that like? The, the, the grass in the middle of the road was thicker than the verges. Yeah, that was, uh, <laughs> not, uh, not a place to get in the middle of it, was it? No. I was thinking of that going up there. Uh, anyway, uh, nice headwind all the way home now. Yeah. <laughs> That's what we came out for. <laughs> no, we came out for the tailwind. Oh well, let's go. I will carry you on my shoulders as long as I'm able. Scare the monsters under your bed. Deep and abiding. Like 
Hey, some things never change. <laughs> Anyway, I do apologise, I forgot all about the fact we were making the video. We've been having a chat all the way back, trying to fight the headwind. Uh, we just ate so much on the Abbey on our way into Langport. But anyway, you didn't miss a lot. Uh, Pete hasn't managed to fall off yet. And uh, there's no gravel. The road's been pretty normal. Yeah, pretty uneventful. Sun's gone in, getting a bit colder. Not a lot else to say, is there? Just very windy. You gotta go, you gotta go. <laughs> I just started to learn and feeling my way through. Guess what, Di? It's downhill all the way home now. No. <laughs> it's not. It's always downhill all the way home. When I say it is. I don't Look, there's the tour. Oh, oh, oh. It's nice to finally be out of that wind. I think it picked up towards the end. <laughs> Definitely seemed to struggle coming in. That or my legs just weren't working. But anyway, that's another ride done. Uh, come up with a plan for next week. And then we've got the Christmas ride in two weeks. The fancy dress Christmas ride. Yeah, and I've been asked today if I'm gonna dress up as Father Christmas again, because I said no last year. And at the moment it's still a no. <laughs> come up with something else this year. That is too hard. Someone else's turn, I think. Definitely. Anyway, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and we will see you next week but hopefully everybody else will be back in the fold seem to have been a busy week this week and i know the christmas party is next week so there might be a few sore heads next week anyway <laughs> anyway thank you for watching we will see you again soon i can handle them all